The Masters of Mankind by L. Chi. Faceless suits in the seats of power. The Masters of Mankind. Unrestrained riches on themselves they shower. The Masters of mankind. Power feeds wealth, and wealth feeds power. Looking down from their ivory tower, the masters of mankind. They allow us to speak, but we don't have a voice. They allow us to vote, but we don't have a choice. They live by the mantra, sisters and brothers, all for themselves and nothing for others. The whitest of collars, the criminal acts, hoarding offshore, avoiding the tax. While the masses are locked in the capitalists' cages, living hand to mouth on minimum wages. Crumb here and there for the poor and the needy, while the lion's share remains with the rich and the greedy, the masters of mankind. Manufactured crisis and perpetual wars, round and round like revolving doors, warmongering makes for lucrative deals, while corpses rot in the oil fields. If the Nuremberg Principles had been observed, indicted they'd be, and time they would serve, the bastards of mankind. They tell us democracy is good for the nation, as they continue their push for world domination. While job insecurity plays a dominant role, keeping workers insecure, keeps them under control, the masters of mankind. The elite and democracy meet in a clash, imposing on their obsession of making more cash. With billions of people on this fast spinning ball, the elite in comparison are very, very small. But the minority continue to keep us in line as they have throughout history, time after time. By use of the media, their powerful tool, which helps them to conquer, divide us and rule. The masters of mankind.